What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video. So today, in this video, we're gonna be trying different kinds of mochis. I literally bought these literally a while ago and I thought now would be a perfect time to make this video. I literally went and got like seven different kinds of mochis, which actually look incredible. They look actually amazing and I can't actually wait to have them. I actually haven't had these in such a long time, literally years or something. So we're gonna be doing that. Um, First of all, I don't know if you guys actually know what a mochi is, uh, but by what Wikipedia says, it says uh, mochi is a glutinous rice cake. It's a Japanese rice cake made of uh, mochi gum, a short green, uh, Japanese glucose rice, and sometimes other ingredients such as water, sugar, and corn syrup. Which to me sounds actually amazing. And obviously, if you could see the images right now, which I will just put right here, um, they actually look so good. They actually look so tasty. Uh, but guys, let's just get straight to the video, okay? Okay, guys, so um, the first ones we're gonna try is these fruit mochis. So in inside here, there's three different kinds. There is um, orange, there is hardy melon and strawberry, okay. So we're literally gonna, we're literally gonna get the first one. Um, I have no, oh, okay, this is, it's just fruit much, but I can't tell which one this is. So we're literally just gonna have to guess. And the thing is about these, they're so difficult to open. But look, look how gooey this is. Wow. Oh my God. Mmm. That is actually incredible. I thought when I, when I was going to take the first bite, I was going to hate it, and this was going to be actually disgusting, but this is so good. Oh my god. Wow. Mmm. 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 Okay, we need to find the other ones. Okay, so... This one, this one by looks of it, it's like, it's all green, so I'm assuming this is like the melon. Mm, that is definitely melon. The flavors are so unique. It's like you've got an actual piece of melon inside your mouth. Oh my god. At one point, I was so addicted to melon that it was unbelievable. Mmm. Oh my god. That is actually amazing. So I'm assuming this last one here is the strawberry one. Mm. Oh my god. It tastes like there's actual strawberries in your mouth. Mmm! Oh my god. Oh my god. That is actually incredible. Okay, so we've done we've done with these ones. I've got tons of these left, but Next, we're going to go into these matcha rolls. Um, all it says here is these matcha rolls with taro milk filling. Um, I don't know what taro milk is, but it literally can't be bad. So, this is uh, the matcha roll. It, when you, if you just look at it, it kind of looks, well, it looks kind of disgusting, but... It's really, it's really, um, it's got a lot of powder, like powdered sugar on top. It's pretty, it's really hard to chew. Mmm. It's good. It's good, but it's not great. It's not great. I feel like if I had another one of those, I would be sick. Oh my god. I don't like that one. I don't like that one at all. Okay, so uh, the next one we're going to do. Um, the banana machis. Okay, these actually look pretty good. These look pretty good. 
So I love bananas. Oh, oh, look how cute the packaging is. It comes with four small little mochis. That is actually so cute. But the, like I said, the thing is with these, it's like they're so, they make it so difficult to open. Okay, I'm just gonna, oh my God, the, look at these. Oh, they actually look so cute. Mmm, mmm. It's like, um, the really cold with powder sugar again, which I'm not a big fan of. And it's like, they don't taste like actual bananas. Do you know those banana sweets you can get? They taste like that. They don't taste like an actual banana, which, you know, still, it's really good though. It still beats the matcha rolls by like a long shot, by 100%. But still, that is really good. The bananas were really good. I feel like I just want another one. Another one. Mmm. Oh my god. They are so good. Mmm. Okay. So the banana ones are literally they're really good. They're up there. But so far, the fruit matches. Um, they are my favorite so far. Especially, probably the melon one. The melon one is definitely probably my favorite. I can't. Okay, so next, it's going to be the Mochi Lava Bites. So, apparently with these, it's, um, I don't even, what, what, what is this? Is it, um, I don't even know what fruit is inside it. But apparently, it's some Mochi inside with a biscuit out there. And again, they come in these, like, really cute packaging. Wait, and they make it so difficult to open. But it, it looks like just like a normal biscuit. But my parents got much inside. Mmm. It's really good. I can't I can't tell for the life of me what what flavor it is. But yeah, it's really good. It's, it's um I don't know. It's actually like a really good snack. Probably something I wouldn't eat like all the time, but it is really good. Ah. Okay, so um, next, next on our list, and this is probably our, one of our final ones, is the bubble tea matches. The bubble tea ones I've been looking forward to. Um, I'm a, I love bubble tea anytime I get a chance to go have some, um, which I haven't done in a while either. And again, look at the cute packaging. And again, they make it so difficult to open. So these, these are the bubble tea matches and just look how prestige they are in these little bung cases. Oh. Okay. The only thing is like I don't like about these is like the amount of powdered sugar on top of them. It's definitely not my favorite. And it's definitely not the worst. It just tastes it just tastes like bubble tea. It just tastes like the bubble tea balls at the bottom of your milk. But it's not something I can physically just eat like that. Oh my god. No, that's definitely not it. So I definitely think the winner of this is the fruit matches. And it looks like I've got a strawberry one. Mm. Oh my god. That is so amazing. Mmm. Yes. The that these fruit matches win it by far. Tell me in the comments below, guys. Uh, what is your favorite kind of Japanese snack? 
or if you love matches, what's your favorite? And tell me to go and buy them. And maybe I can make a part two to this video tasting different kind of matches. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching this video. Um, if you haven't already, please go and smash that like button. Uh, go and comment down below. Tell me a different kind of stuff you want me to do. If you want me to go to back to the Japanese stores, and pick up some different snacks to try them on, in, on camera. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. Just tell me down below. Uh, tell me what other kind of little videos you want me to do. Tell me other snacks you want me to taste. And I'll do it. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And if you haven't already, like I said, please go smash the hell out that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. But anyway, guys, until next time, peace. I forgot about the fortune cookie, so I'm eating the fortune cookie now.